Welcome to an introductory demonstration of Kodak Info Input Solution, a web-based capture solution for both distributed and centralized capture, enabling enterprises to transform their capture infrastructure and push out capture to wherever it is required by users simply accessing a browser. To start Info Input Solution, a user simply opens a browser and enters a specified URL, or a shortcut, if provided. Then a user would provide their username password or, if enabled, log in using their Windows login credentials. Single sign-on can also be used with Info Input. As you can see, Info Input has an extremely simple and user-friendly interface with minimal controls and icons. This minimizes user training and results in less errors that need to be addressed in a downstream business process. Info Input Solution can capture documents in the following ways. Scanning for both distributed and centralized applications, keeping up with scanners running up to 210 pages per minute. Drag and dropping documents from the desktop or attachments from emails. Importing documents from file systems or shared folders throughout an organization or from a user's clipboard and from an Info Input mobile application available for both iOS and Android devices. To start a batch, the user selects the scan icon. From here, the desired job can be selected. Also, announcements can be displayed alerting users to changes or updates. Create and Scan is selected and documents start to be scanned. During scanning, there is a live preview window the first page of each document is kept persistent to validate proper document separation, while the other pages are displayed to the operator to check for any scanning or image quality issues that can be immediately addressed. A user can work with documents using the Batch Page View, as seen here, or using the Batch Tree View. There is also a zoom control to allow users to enlarge or reduce the size of images being viewed. There are many capabilities to ensure proper construction and quality of documents. Users can hover over the magnifying glass icon and the document will fly out for closer inspection. This can be done from both the page view and the batch tree view. Here we find a document with a barcode that could not be read, so a document break did not occur. This can be easily remedied by simply placing the cursor where the break should occur, a scissors icon will appear, and clicking the mouse will automatically create a document break. Pages within a document can be moved by simply drop and dragging them to where they need to be, or rotated for proper viewing. There is the ability to merge document with the previous or next document, or by rescanning them or importing documents from a file share. Additionally, users can drop and drag documents into a batch from the user's desktop or attachments from emails. To work closer with a document, the user can enter the document single page view. Here there are many options to work with the document. The zoom control provides the ability to zoom in on a particular area of interest. When this is done, you will notice that a page navigation thumbnail is provided to indicate where within the document the user is viewing and to help make it easier to move around the page. A powerful capability of Info Input Solution is being able to apply annotations and comments to a document. A user can provide useful notations such as apply pre-canned or custom stamps, use a pen tool to highlight certain information on a document, or use a text tool to provide instructions to a user downstream in a workflow. This ensures clear communications as to the status of a document and or required actions all leading to fewer errors and post-capture exception processing. When the user is satisfied with the construction and the quality of the document, indexing can now be done. To index, the user simply selects the document to be indexed and selects the index icon, and the document is again in the page view. The index fields are associated with predefined fields that are on the document. On this document, a database lookup is triggered by reading the barcode. 
Notice there is a zoom zone that enlarges and displays the data in the field that is highlighted on the document. Here we find the document with the barcode that could not be read, causing indexing information to not be provided. Notice the only field that is populated is the city field, as this index data was defined to be supplied by a zonal OCR extraction. To supply the rest of the index data, the user places the cursor in the appropriate field, selects the rubber band OCR tool, draws a box around the data on the document, and the index field is automatically populated. When going to the next field, a database lookup is triggered and all the rest of the associated index data is provided. When the user is completed with the batch, they can select New Batch and choose what action to take with the current batch. If Close Batch is selected, the current batch advances to the next processing step and the new batch dialog immediately appears. There is no waiting for the prior batch to upload before a new batch can begin. To find out more about Kodak Info Input Solution and request a more in-depth demo, visit us at www.kodakalaris.com.